The Central Statistical Office in preparation for the National Population Housing Census held a census management meeting at the Finance Administrative Center on February 2022. The meeting focused on the importance of a national census and implementation plans for St. Lucia's next census set for May 2022. The national census, which was originally stated for March 2020, was disrupted by the COVID-19 pandemic. Sean Mafre is the Director of Statistics. During the intervening period, we worked on two aspects of our preparations. We worked on the further de development of the questionnaire, and also we worked on designing and developing a software or system that would further enhance the data collection aspects of the, the, the census. Um, it, must, it should be pointed that this census will be one if a different for three main reasons. The first reason is that we will be conducting a census utilizing tablets for the very first time. It will be a paper-based census. The second reason that this one is one with a difference is that we would, uh, would use the opportunity that the census affords us to do an establishment census. Now, this in itself, doing this during a pandemic also has some inherent challenges because the intention is for us to visit every single establishment on island. And the third reason that this is a, a, a census of a difference is that we'll be actually doing a census during a pandemic. We've never undertaken a census um, during a pandemic. And like the business cens um, census, the population housing census, the, as the objective is to visit every single household on the island. Deputy Director of Statistics Richard Harris noted the objectives of the census. One of the fundamental objectives of these types of censuses is to form the basis for the establishment of sampling frames that will help facilitate future statistical investigations or as they are more commonly known, surveys. Okay, now without these surveys, it's very, very difficult for us to get the information that is required to inform our policies in respect of the development of our individual industries on the island, our entertainment industries, our tourism industry, and so on and so forth, and the overall economy as, and the overall economy. The Central Statistical Office is collaborating with the Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs to ensure the safe implementation of the national exercise. Dr. Glensford Joseph, Medical Officer in the Ministry of Health, Wellness and Elderly Affairs, highlights the key ways to stay safe during the data collection process. The protocols are being implemented to ensure that we're able to uh, conduct this activity in a very safe way to the numerators as well as to the respondents, you, the residents, the business personnel, and each and every one of us out there. Just remember, even though we're going to provide more information as uh, we go along, uh, always remember what works, we have seen what works, the protocols. When it is being implemented, we have seen the benefits. So when they come to you, maintain your distance. Ensure that you sanitize your hands or wash your hands before engaging, even though they're going to be going, coming through with a, a paperless uh, method of collecting the information. Uh, we ensure that you wear your mask, always have your mask at hand, so by the time they get to your uh, uh, residence or business places that you always have your mask. And I'm going to leave. We still have an opportunity to vaccinate because we see vaccine work. All factors permitting, the census is set to commence 10th May 2022 for a period of five months.